What's the crack? What's the bleeding story? Another adventure, another vlog. Today we're going to see Pats versus Shelbourne. We were in Shelbourne, Tolka Park. That's the name of the stadium. That's where we were last week. It was a nil-nil draw with Drogheda. Today we're going to the Richmond Park. So that's where St. Patrick's Athletic, St. Pats in other words, uh, play. So they're playing actually, happens to be Shelbourne. Um, so yeah, looking forward to the game. Um, I'm, I'm hearing good things. I've never been to Richmond Park before. I'm hearing that the like you know the, the atmosphere and seeing on videos and stuff like that that it does be absolutely bouncing around the place. So I'm really looking forward to that. And um, the boys are excited. Jake, are you excited? Yeah. Really excited? Yeah. Or just a small bit? Really excited. Yeah. <laughs> Zach, what about you? I'm really excited to see the atmosphere as well because I only saw Shelburne's atmosphere. That was. Yeah. All right, I guess. Yeah. So we get in amongst the atmosphere, the singing, the dancing, everything like that. And uh, let's hope it lives up to what we are expecting. So Ooh. come on, the boys. Let's do this. And now we're to kick off. Um, we're just traveling down. I'd say we were tw about 15, 20 minutes away. Uh, hopefully we find parking okay. Um, we're told it's a bit bit messy with the parking around the area but I know one or two streets around the stadium where I think I might find a home for the van so let's hope right so we had a bit of trouble there trying to get parking nightmare <laughs> absolute nightmare but look let's not put that dampener on and we got a place we're just walking now is that right yeah yeah is that right yeah so yeah we can hear the hear the stadium bouncing now um, we're just starting to queue up now I to can't. get in for the, for the stand. There's 10 minutes left to kick off, so hopefully we get in and get our seats. Well, the game has ended. Shelbourne nil, St. Pat's won. Owen Doyle on the 84th minute. Uh, scoring a goal, I don't know if it's controversial. It looked like the defender uh, was pulled down. Um, I'm not too sure. The Shelbourne defender was pulled down. Um, I'd have to see the replay, to be honest with you. Um, I don't know, Zach, Jake, did you think... You had probably a better view than me, but did you think that it was... Uh, um, did you think it was a pull down from the, the Pats player or what, what do you reckon? Yeah, I think it was, um, he pulled down the player, so I don't think, I think, um, he should have really checked, or there's no VAR. No, no VAR in no the VAR, League of Ireland. No VAR, so, um, what can he do? Yeah, this is it, there's nothing you can do, you know? Mm. Um, so, yeah, it'll be interesting to see what, what, like, you know, our point of view from the game was. But um, no, it was a good game. The atmosphere was absolutely brilliant from both sets of fans. There was 4,900 at the game, which is absolutely great for a League of Ireland game. Um, and the, the attendances this week again have been absolutely brilliant. So it's great for the Irish League that, like you know, there's revenue being put into clubs and stuff like that. So long may it last. Um, the, um, the there was flares and all going off which was great like you know there was singing from both sets of fans it was really good like you know i really enjoyed myself jake how did you think the match went did you enjoy yourself 
And what did any players, subs or anything come up and say hello to you? Yeah. You got a high five and you got um what did you get? Fist pumps and stuff like that as yeah. well. Absolutely great. So the substitutes you can just imagine how close you are to the ground and like you know, um Damien Duff as it says the Shelbourne manager, so it's good to see um like you know, you can get up close to them for the kids, like you know what I mean? But Zach, what did you make of the game? I think it was very good. 1-0. I think we should have won. But um yeah, like I said, what can you do? Um They we I think we were kinda all over, so I think we should have got um uh uh panel. Yeah, probably up the other end, yeah, yeah. Like you know, we, we were we were let's say in the way end behind the goal. and um, so sometimes it's hard to see up that close, like you know what I mean? But um yeah, look, really enjoyable game. Um, hopefully, it, like you know, the crowds keep coming and keep supporting their local team and stuff like that. Next week, we are going to the Shamrock Rovers v Derry City. Looking forward to going to that to the Tallis Stadium. And um, there's a new stand at the moment being put in. And um, so, yeah, I'm looking forward to that next week. And the boys will be coming with me as well. And um, so, Derry Shamrock Rovers would be pretty much a, a very good game, strong game to go to. And just uh, back on tonight's game. I probably thought a, a draw would have been a fair result in my opinion. But look, hey ho, didn't get the goal, and that's what happens. So thanks a million. Please do hit the like button, subscribe if you don't, if you're not already. Really would appreciate it. Um, and thanks a million for for checking out our videos and putting comments in and all stuff like that. Really appreciate it. Thanks a million. Uh, take care. God bless you all.